Hey guys, it's me, Tins. I'm actually back with this look. And it's a black, um, kind of taupe and purple look. I know since I ever look I've been doing lately has been purple, but anyway, nonetheless, I'm just really feeling that um, right now. And if you want to see how to get this look, just keep watching. Alright guys, so we're going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to be using the Urban Decay Book of Shadows to do this look. Um, this look does require a little bit more time, so um, this isn't one of those looks you want to rush into doing, so just keep that in mind. going to take with my MAC 226, and I'm going to dip it in this color, Perversion. It's, um, uh, I want to say it's a black color, but I don't know. Something about it doesn't seem quite black to me. Just gonna start right in my crease. I'm gonna create an outer V. Okay, and then to be just a little bit more precise, I'm just gonna take my two seven two nineteen and sweep it in. So you should have something like that right about now. And then I'm going to take my 239 and I'm going to take this color called Mayhem. Really pretty vibrant purple. I'm really going to load my brush up with it. I'm going to pack it right in on the lid. Okay, so once you have that packed onto the lid, just going to take your 219 and then just blend out that inner corner. Okay, and then you are going to take with your 224, no I'm sorry, with your 217, this color called Gridlock, just pack that. And just go right up and use this as your highlight right up to your brow bone. And you're just going to blend it ever so lightly with that black. Not going to go in too far. And just blend the outer edges. Take my 224 just to kind of soften up everything. I have a feeling that this side is going to come out a little bit better, but that's all right. All right, and then you're going to take. Um, you're going to go on the bottom with your 219 and just add that mayhem to your lower lash line. Taking the black perversion, going right in the middle, and just smudging it out. And then you're taking grit lock. And you're just extending from that outer corner in. And it's going to go completely around. Okay. Okay. And then it's going back in. Make sure you keep um, that perversion really 
deep in the crease. Keep it dark. Don't let too much of that grit lock take the color away. Okay, so once you have, sorry about my bangs y'all. Once you have that, you're going to line the eye. And I suggest a cream liner for this because with how heavy the shadow is on, um, a pencil really is not going to work. So I'm taking my hip cream liner. Um, actually, I do have to take, um, this is regular eyeliner pencil and going right on the inside um, right on the inside right there taking my cream liner and just staying really close to the lash line oh, crap, my hands are slippery <laughs> I'm just creating that wing just like that. And then I'm going to clean up where I overdid it a little bit on the liner. Okay. And that's okay. No biggie. Take a little bit of that perversion and it's going to go back over there. Got a little bit thicker so you know it's makeup. Just go back and make this one a little bit thicker. And that's the fun of makeup. Okay. And you just have a little wing right out there to the side. And that is pretty much it for the look, you all. So it is quite dramatic. I recommend this look for, you know, going out. Um, you know, just an occasion where you are, um, you know, not day wear. This is a really cool club look really cool fun look that is it so I hope you all like it let me know what you think this is a lot more dramatic than what I usually do but you know just have some fun with the colors and experiment that's the whole point of makeup so um you just you know do your eyebrows I have no idea where half of my stuff is, y'all. I'm sorry. I'm going to take this Stila. Adding a little bit of pink because you have to keep things quite pink. Keep it rosy on the... Take my Rimmel Sexy Curve. And, you know, you can apply, you know, your desired coats of it. Completely up to you. And then next, you want to apply Wonder Shine. I can get it open. To my lips. And because my eyes are so dark. And keeping the lips quite neutral. So anyhow, I hope you all like the look. Dramatic eyes, simple lips, rosy cheeks, and um, let me know what you guys think. Thanks so much for watching. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.